The black hole in Interstellar wasn't just movie CGI, it was real science brought to life. That stunning 10 second shot, it took 24,000 hours to render. And if you tried it on a normal laptop, you'd be waiting 8 years to finish. Christopher Nolan didn't want imagination, he wanted truth. So, he worked with Nobel Prize winning physicist Kip Thorne, using Einstein's real relativity equations to simulate the behavior of light and matter around a black hole. The result? The most scientifically accurate black hole visualization ever created, not just for cinema, but for science itself. Years later, when scientists captured real black hole images, they looked different. And Kip Thorne explained why. Stellar, but we're going to move the camera up to the North Pole and see what happens. It's pretty obvious. You lose the crossbar. Out. Because the radio astronomers don't have very good